SR-72 is a new hypersonic demonstrator aircraft developed by Lockheed Martin under the Skunk Works or Advanced Development Program to meet the requirements of the United States Air Force. The high-speed SR-72 aircraft will be designed and built as a successor to the Lockheed Martin SR-71 Blackbird, which retired from USAF service in 1998. Development of the SR-72 hypersonic aircraft in demonstrator form began in 2018. Being an optional flight research vehicle approximately 60 feet long, it is equipped with two full-scale engines to maneuver for several minutes in 10 games. The SR-72 aircraft will have the capability to conduct high-speed intelligence surveillance and ISR reconnaissance and strike operations. The first flight of the SR-72 demonstrator is anticipated in 2023, while the full-scale aircraft is expected to enter service in 2030. Details of the development of the SR-72 aircraft Lockheed Martin has attempted in various ways as a successor to the SR-71 since 1998, but has failed to develop a high-speed aircraft. Lockheed Martin Skunk Works is also developing a rocket that launches a hypersonic technology vehicle, the HEV-2. The aircraft is part of the DARPA Institute Advanced Research Project and Falcon Research and Development Project, Project HTV-2, developed for data collection on guidance aerodynamics, aerothermal effects, navigation, and control of the completed HTV-2. Its maiden flight was in April 2010, and its second flight was in August 2011. The vehicle reached a maximum match speed of 2013,000 miles per hour. Substantial experience and data was gained from the HDV-2, which was used to share some of the better design features for the SR-72 aircraft. The SR-72 aircraft will be a merger of the hypersonic strategic reconnaissance aircraft with the MLB side advanced hypersonic technology for similar missions and ranges offered by the SR-71 aircraft. The new aircraft is expected to be able to engage targets anywhere across the continent in less than an hour when equipped with high-speed hypersonic missiles such as the Lockheed Martin high-speed weapons attack. This aircraft ensures penetration into protected airspace. The SR-72 will be optionally equipped to engage in combat operations. The aircraft's development is supported by the U.S. Air Force's long-term hypersonics roadmap. The SR-72 will be optionally equipped to engage in combat operations. The aircraft's development is supported by the U.S. Air Force's long-term hypersonics roadmap.